So, it appears to me that while listening to The Wolf this morning, which is a radio station in Peterborough here, as the Osborne was upset along with Sharon that Donald Trump used Crazy Train in one of his speeches a while back. And I made a speech a long time ago, one of my videos, that Hulk Hogan was no longer following Obama because... Obama used Real American, and I thought, well, Hulk Hogan's a fucking moron. He didn't sing Real American. Rick Derringer did. You know, and I understand that politicians want to use music to make their speeches interesting. I don't know. It's just one of those things where, yeah, permission is key. Ask permission. I don't care if you're the president, prime minister, queen of England. You know... Yeah, and the thing is, also, devil's advocate, I've even used copyrighted music myself in my videos, and that's, you know, I understand why that's not okay. I try to not do that anymore, but the fact is, Donald Trump's an asshole anyways, and I'm Canadian, I shouldn't care, you know, and I don't know why he wanted to use Crazy Train anyways. As he's British. It's like a long time ago, Arnold Schwarzenegger running for government and fucking having D. Snyder do, we're not gonna take it. Which I thought was, eh. I'm not a Republican, so I don't give a shit. But I think that Ozzy Osbourne has every right to be pissed off. That's just my opinion. You know, I understand that some people do use copyrighted music, but it's kind of like, try to use something else to make your speeches better, but what I, I mean, it is what it is. Anyways, Wheels of Fury will do tonight, and we'll record it, but yeah, that's something I wanted to mention, because I think that, yeah, you gotta ask permission, regardless of who you are. Sometimes it's hard, but that's just the way it is, you know. But, anyways, I don't know enough about politics, and I'll talk to you later.